And then there were four. Both teams have dazzled and delighted us throughout. But who will make it to the World Cup final? Stay tuned, we're live next on EA TV. Hello, good evening to you, and part of the story here is the Albight Stadium by night, 60,000 capacity here. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And we're about to bring you a very big occasion indeed, the semi-final of the World Cup. It's Argentina versus Croatia. Well, this could be an absolute classic, and the prize couldn't be any bigger, could it? A place in the World Cup final. Let's just hope we get two teams that want to play good football come out and attack the opposition. This should be a good game. The Argentina first team. Well, it's a great system when played well, but it's very reliant on wide players who have the pace to run behind the opposition and fullbacks that are good going forward. Well, they certainly have both of those. And the starting 11 for Croatia. Luka Modric plays alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And the contest begins... Bruno Petkovic, Ivan Perisic, and getting the ball forward, Perisic, well real difficulty keeping the ball, important facet of his play, holding the ball up and waiting for support, options in the centre, the bar excellent effort it was well sometimes players are overhyped but I don't think we can use that word in connection with Lionel Messi well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. Bona Barisic. Now Brozovic. Barisic. Could cross it in here. Just clarify the injury situation. Our man on the side of the pitch is Jeff Shreves. Seems to me that his foot's the problem because he's got trodden in that last challenge. Cheers, Jeff. And can they create something? But he drifted into an offside position. Well, he just thought about the pass for a fraction too long, and that's why it's offside. Well, perhaps he thought he might escape punishment. Not the case. It's a booking.
Brozovic. Perisic with the ball. Kovacic. Kovacic! Oh, good save. Marcos Acuna. Alexis McAllister. Now with Gomez. Rodrigo de Paul. Gomez. Now Messi. Defended well. Ivan Perisic. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? And space to cross it. And the cross not sufficiently well played in. Look at Modric. And on to Kovacic. Now Brozovic. And the cross fired over, but no real central pressure applied. Well, he's given us away. The threat was very real. Marvellous defending. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Well, as you can see from the stats, there's been little between the two teams. It's been really tight, really cagey. Let's just hope it opens up and one of these teams is willing to take a few risks. Modric. And moving the ball nicely. Kramaric. He could pick out a teammate. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Modric. Read it well. Kramaric. And return to Modric. Tremendous block. Nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Bruno Petkovic. Return to Perisic. Can he finish? And with that, the first half draws to a close. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Luka Modric. Giving it a try. Terrific block. Molina. De Paul. Messi. Messi. Here's Alvarez. And teammates to play it to. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Enzo Fernandez. Magnificent defending.
Racing forward, trying to catch them out. They need to get bodies back. And just slightly offside. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. Fernandez. Perfect tackle. On the offensive. Andrej. Kramaric. Here's Modric. Kovacic. Still level here. But the pressure escalating. Perisic. Here's Modric. Kovacic. And return to Modric. And it all counts for naught. Lionel Messi. Now well Molina. Lionel Messi. Paredes. Gomez. Well, not on the target. The keeper seemed to have it covered. Well, he did seem to have it covered, but it's not a bad effort, though. He really did strike it well. Substitution, then. Let's see how it affects the match. Josip Juranovic and into the last 20 minutes Vlasic and they find a gap in the defence well they couldn't keep that sequence going unfortunately Gomez Rodrigo de Paul Gomez now Messi Marcos Acuna. Lionel Messi. Can he put them in front? And there it is! The first goal of the semi final. A huge moment. Extraordinary scenes. Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back heel. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Vlasic. Ivan Perisic. He read the situation defensively and did his job. This might be ideal for the counter. And he's made headway. Well, wasted opportunity here. Would have been a decent chance, but offside the verdict. Just 10 minutes to go. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. First into the penalty area. A bit wasteful from Argentina. Kovacic. And the keeper there to deal with it. Well, this might be the final opportunity to draw level. In by Luka Modric. Oh, and nearly on target. Not quite, though. Yeah, very nearly, but the goalkeeper had it covered. It wasn't really a great effort.
Ramaric. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Luka Modric. Oh, moving it nicely. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Obrich. This could square the game. Oh, it's in! Can you believe it? Back on level terms. And the dream of making the final is very much alive again. Incredible. Well, here it is again, and when you clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. They don't do that, it's a poor clearance, and suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Goal. So back underway, following the equaliser. This is looking promising. Can they push ahead on the club? Oh, there it is! And surely we've witnessed the goal that will take them through to the final. Astonishing scenes here. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. taking part in the 2022 World Cup final. Well, it was far from easy at times. They certainly know they've been in a match today, but these are the sort of games you have to get through if you want to win silverware. They've done that, and now they can turn their attention to that final. What a game that should be. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's put in a really authoritative performance here. Well, I thought we had a good all-round performance today only emphasized by the late winner an extremely important moment and boy did he deliver